Hey there, my name is Markus Düsterft and I'm one of the product trainers here at DocuSign University. In this trainer tip video, we'll dive into document visibility, where you can control which document each recipient can see within an envelope or a template. Instead of creating separate envelopes for different recipients, you can streamline your workflows by sending a single envelope with multiple documents, hiding or displaying documents as needed. This saves time, reduces cost, and makes tracking easier compared to managing multiple envelopes. It also ensures a clear audit trail, providing proof that all documents were signed as part of the same transaction. Now, let's take you through how to set up document visibility step by step. To enable document visibility, you'll need admin access. Go to admin, to access account settings, then sending settings, and scroll down to find document visibility. If you don't see this option, you will need to contact your DocuSign account team to enable it. In the drop-down, you'll find four options to configure document visibility. These fall into two main categories. Let the sender do the site per envelope. Choose one of the sender can set options if you want senders to control visibility each time they send an envelope. Or apply one setting for all envelopes. This ensures senders cannot change visibility settings per envelope with must sign to view options. By default, when document visibility is off, all recipients can see every document in the envelope. But when it is enabled, while senders always have access to all documents, the recipients can only view documents where they have at least one assigned field, like a signature, initials, or text field. There are some exceptions. You can allow all account users to see all documents by selecting one of the must sign to view unless a member of sender's account options. This makes it more transparent, for example, for involved internal colleagues. For stricter control, you can choose an option with must sign to view unless sender. So only the sender has full visibility, but not members like your colleagues. If you want senders to control visibility per envelope while still allowing all account members to see documents, choose Sender Can Set Must Sign to View unless a member of sending account, which is what we will use for flexibility and transparency. Remember to click Save to apply the changed settings. Now let's look at enabling and configuring document visibility in an envelope. Here we have an example of two signers and one carbon copy recipient. Both signers can view and sign the second document, but only the second signer can view and sign the first document, while the carbon copy recipient can view both documents. To start, create a new envelope and add your documents and recipients. Here we have two signers and one carbon copy recipient. We want both signers to sign the sales contract, but only the second signer to view and sign the internal checklist, while the carbon copy recipient can view both documents. Since we set up our account to allow the sender to enable document visibility, we will need to enable it by clicking Advanced Options and selecting the Recipient Must Be Signers to View Signed Documents checkbox. Click Next and place the fields for your recipients. When document visibility is enabled, needs to sign recipients can only see documents on which they have been assigned at least one field. In this example, we want the first recipient to see and sign both documents, so we place a field for them on each document. And the second recipient only needs to view and sign the second document, so we place their field on that one document only. When you're done adding fields, click the gear icon next to Documents and select Document Visibility to make sure the envelope is correctly configured. If Document Visibility option does not appear, this feature may need to be enabled by your account administrator. This opens up a visibility table or matrix. We can confirm here that the first recipient can see both documents because they have been assigned fields on each document. 
The second recipient cannot see the first document because they do not have any field on this document. They can only see the second document. The third recipient who has been assigned the receives a copy action can see both documents. You can uncheck any of the visible checkboxes to hide a document from this recipient. Note though, you can only hide a document from a recipient who does not have any fields placed on the document. Click done and then send to send your envelope. Learn more about document visibility and many other e-signature features by accessing DocuSign University to view our course catalog and webinar schedule. Thank you and happy signing everybody. Thank you.